Alright, <clears throat> welcome to a brand new episode of the Doa and Juice Podcast. It's your boy Doa, you know what it is. Doa Brown's Wine Review, alright. Ah, tonight we got Frontierio, award winning wine. It's a Merlot, alright. Um, 2018 uh, wine. Uh, company from around 1883. Whew, uh, made in Chile, Central Valley Chile. Alright, um... It says cherry notes and with a hint of cocoa. Uh, prevailing smooth, supple Merlot. Served better with um, pizza, grilled chicken, and burgers. I got a little, some some pizza with me tonight. You know what I'm saying? I might be chomping off. But yes, yes, yes. This is the, the wine of, of the night. You know what I'm saying? So it's your boy. You know where it is, though. You know I got my glass with me. You already know. And um, tonight, you know I'm speaking on. I'm speaking on stocks tonight. You know, we're going to talk about GameStop and, and AMC and all that. And I'm going to tell you how, about my little experience about it. All right. Anybody know me? You know, I've been in the stocks for a little bit. You know, Deucey put me on. And my, and my man Rob, they're the ones who really introduced me to stocks. All right. So, boy, you know, I was in it. You know what I'm saying? So, I do a lot of research now. Like, I ain't going to lie. When I get into things, I'm a, I get addicted to it. I start, you know... Watching YouTube videos, doing a lot of different things that I, um, you know, just watching a lot of little different things that I'm, I, you know, puts me on that maybe start doing research on it. So your boy been in the lab now. Let me taste this thing. Oh yeah, oh yeah. All right. So your boy been in the lab now with the. Um, you know, with all the uh, stuff going on, you know, the other day, you know, my man hit me up like, "Yo, you watching? You see the GameStop? You know what I'm saying? On, on the, um, on the Robinhood? I'm like, let me check it out. I went. She was like eighty eight dollars, ninety dollars. I was like, man, I'm not messing with this shit. You know what I'm saying? And then actually, you know, then she got out of hand. But funny part was, then on that day, it was like that day on that next morning, I was like, you know, I'm gonna buy me some AMC stock. I look at this, it was like four dollars. I was like, I'm just gonna buy me a cheap stock that. You know, something because I just sold some stocks in, in one company and I had $200. I was like, look, put a buck fifty in um, Neo and I, I said, let me put $50 in AMC to buy some shares. It was like $4. So I'm like, I'm just not even thinking about it. So, you know, I'm telling my homeboy and all that. You know, it was like, you know, AMC, you think the movies come back? I really did it because I'm thinking, like, when movies come back, $4. At worst, AMC might get $10, $20. Who knows? I'm not even doing it for the trying to think I'm getting a, a come up. Man, next morning, I look, GameStop off the chain. I look at AMC, AMC jumping up. I'm like, whoa, my little $4, $22. So I'm like, I'm on a ride. Now, this is what I tell you about, about stocks, where you have to um, think about long-term investment or trading. I know what you are and know what you not. I had to come to the grip sometimes that Shannon, you're not a trader. You're more of a long-term investor. So put your money in these nice companies, the big companies, and leave all that quick shit to the people who do it. You know what I'm saying? You might get lucky. And think you might get lucky. Being a long-term investor, you might get lucky on the stock, and that might pop off. But know who you are. Day traders and stuff like that, they got to do this research every single day, every minute. Cause they, every day they're looking for a stock to get in and get out. You know what I'm saying? Me, I still, but the thing is, me doing the research, I'm starting to learn about this stuff now. Again, I did the research, I see why, what happened with the Redditors, and basically big co- companies, corporations, you know, betting against the GameStop, so everybody started, you know, going to the GameStop and all that stuff. So, with the AMC, I came up a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I got up, cashed out a little, you know, got out, cashed up a little bit. Okay. Got my son here, my man. He, he want cookies, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm getting him some cookies. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Oh, he's got crumbs all over it, bro. Hold on. Where your ball at? Where your ball? Get out. Get out. It's trash, it's trash. Get out of here. Now, back what I was saying. So, with the Redditors and all that. You know, I started doing some research and I seen what you know what was going on. I see everybody, you know, putting put you know so the billionaire hedge funds had the puts against the uh, GameStop betting is gonna go down. So I'm looking at it like, hey, everybody's getting paid. 
I was still, I'm not, I'm not messing with GameStop. But then, I like, I'm buying some more AMC. F this shit. And like, but then they, Robert was like, no, nah, you can't buy nothing. They, they did some grimy, you know, some grimy BS that they saying that, you know what I'm saying, that they couldn't buy into it. Which I was kind of like pissed because I'm like, yo, y'all platform, you can't just make up the rules, change the rules in the middle of it. You know what I'm saying? That's messed up for all the people that's using your platform. So... I'm like, that was wrong, but it is what it is, you know, but again, it made me start doing more research on these companies and stuff like that, like small companies and seeing what's going on in the world. Cause sometimes, you know, if you had a couple thousand on the GameStop and you came up, you know what I'm saying? So they, it's a war going on, but I did some more research and just listen to more interviews. They, people was like, yo, these people who had the big money, they're losing it. They're going to start selling shares in the other companies, the big companies to pay for that put that they put on that's not going to reach. So me thinking like, oh shit, Apple's, Tesla, Amazon, all these people are start, the, the 1% who really run this world, they're going to start selling. And damn sure Friday, it was bloody today, it was crazy in the, in a, in a, in a, um, on Robin Hood, an investor, everything went down, all the stocks were down. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody took a hit. But, you know, I tell everybody, you know, when the, when the price is low, that's when you start buying. Um, you know, you got different currencies. Got they say dog coin, um, you know, Bitcoin, all that stuff. I bought a little bit of dog coin. I got my hand in the dice game, trying to you know, quick fifty hundred dollars, try to come up with that. But at the end of the day, it's know your role. There's gonna be a market crash coming up. Everybody knows. It's like stuff like this, everybody knows gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? What? Oh, that's good. That's nice. You know what I'm saying? So everybody know the market crash is coming. All right, we all know it's coming. So I protect yourself, but um, I'm not gonna lie. Investing has been the best thing that ever happened to me because now it gives me myself more time to start thinking and learning about this stuff. So I'm telling y'all, that's that's crazy how everything went. Was for this wine, it's definitely good. Um, definitely recommend it. I ain't gonna lie, this is some good wine. I can taste the um, the flavor, cherry flavor with a little bit of chocolate. It's definitely a good wine. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, but. Besides that, I'm telling y'all, my big play is this. Um, bet Apple. Bet all the companies you know are going to be Home Depot. The companies, they're not, they're not going anywhere. Uh, Amazon, these companies are not going nowhere. So keep pumping the bread into that because they're going to come back up. The money, Tesla, everybody. I'm buying, I'm buying them while they're cheap. You know, I'm putting all my bread in that. And, um, you know, these, these, these other little splash mobs and all that, you know, it, you can get in, get out. Learn that, do that. But um, another thing I'm trying to express, and I'm going to do myself, uh, Robinhood is cool. I'm just going to I'm gonna start taking my, my money out and put it into other accounts, uh, like Fidelity or Charles Schwab, somebody else. And um, that's going to be my main accounts for my long-term stuff, so I know I can't touch that stuff. And you get this stuff at a cheap price, so now I know everything's about to get cheap. I'm going to take all my bread, not, not all my bread, but most of my little bit, of, you know, some, some good money and put it over there. And Robert Hood will be the, just the play, the play account, you know, for all the stuff you want to shake the dice with and stuff like that. Because, um, you know, these platforms are tricky. You, want, you never want to have all your money in one platform. But um, like I said, with the GameStop and with the um, AMC and all that, these companies, there's going to be more because now everybody is going to start betting against these hedge funds when they start betting against other stuff. So there's going to be more of this going on. I'm going to put myself, you know, I got $100, $200, we spend that on shoes or bullshit every day on uh, fast food. So I'm willing to definitely play the game with somebody for a quick come up. But um, long-term investment, and then I'll tell you, you know, one thing about me, I'm going to start teaching my, my daughter. She's older, she's 13 now. I'm going to start teaching about investments and stuff like that. Got this thing that you should teach your kids how to do this stuff. Um, you know, school is cool and all that, but you got to do your, your yourself. And honestly... I've been doing this for like four months now, and I'm not no master, but I damn sure been getting better and better. And like I said, it's it's, it's great, you know, investing and learning how the, the stock market works and learning these companies. You're only getting gaining knowledge. So, me personally, I think you you know at the end of the day, try it, learn it, do what you want to do. Gang stop. God bless you. you. Caught if you caught that wave. More power to you. I missed out on that. I was shook daddy. I wasn't messing with it. AMC, I caught a little bit of that. But um, at the end of the day, you know, it's a blessing that we, we're able, we're learning, and it's a good conversation to have. You know, if you know stuff in the comments, you got anything to say, let me know. Um, I love talking this talk because I think that it's, you know, I, I love learning. I don't know everything about the stock market, but I know what's been going on. It's been crazy. 
All right, so what, in the comments, let me know what you're feeling, your feelings about the stock market, about the GameStop, about any of this stuff that has been going on, AMC, they letting people, you know, Robert Hood letting people bet back in and stuff like that, and at a, you got to buy sh whole shares and stuff like that, some grimy stuff they've been doing. But at the end of the day, the one thing I did learn, you can't have all your money in one platform. So start diversifying your money in different, these different platforms. Don't have all your money in one platform. It's like having all your money in one big account. You need to have multiple accounts to just get something go wrong with one. You have you can go somewhere else. All right. As for the wine, look, skill. This is a five out of five. I definitely recommend this. This is very, it's good. Um, Frontier, definitely a good wine. I'm telling y'all, get it. It's, I like it. It's tasty. Get it, get it, get it. I recommend it, all right? It's your boy from Doe. Your boy Doe from Doe Juice Podcast. I'm out. Like, share, and subscribe to this video. Please like this video. Please, please, please. And recommend any wines. Boy, I got, you see, I got the wines in the back. Holla at you, boy, all right? I appreciate everybody watching the video. Thanks.